I'm Barbara Patterson and I'm a sculptor. I started out as a, as a painter and when I went back to university I took a sculpture course and loved it. It was kind of what I wanted to do with paint, sort of a three-dimensional thing. I like to refer to my work as a monumental task because for me it is working from scratch on something and uh, with the people that have actually uh, have developed something, they've invented something, they've um, they've changed the world in their in their way, and so I want to pay, pay tribute to them for that. But I I have that feeling whether I, I would like to think that they're there helping me do this. When they asked me to create the monument uh, to Henry Marshall Torrey and Alexander Rutherford, I was more than thrilled because it's those are two names that are. They are, the, they are the university, and I want to present what they did uh, to give them credit for it. I've put these two men in a situation where they are in a discussion over what their, their vision is and will be. They are looking at a document which uh, was uh, taken from the original drawings of, of, the, uh, of the area where the university is now built. And I don't know that their discussion was, uh, I don't know who was the leader. I don't know which one was actually wanting this and trying to get the other one to, to do it. I think they were both coming from, one had the academic approach, the other one had the financial push in, in the political things. And the details are important to me. I like to have um, their outfits look like what they are. Buttons look like buttons, the right size. and. The robes, I wanted to have a flowing robe. Uh, so those are what, they don't seem like details because they're large, but they are details. I'm thrilled uh, with the, the site that has been chosen for this monument. It's in the middle of the, of the campus, it's where it should be, it's accessible, and I think to have it right there and available for people to, to actually have their pictures taken with the Founding Fathers. That's, that's my thrill. There's not a lot of places that you can stand beside a premier and a president of a university all in one shot. So I think that that's going to be a, a, good, uh, a good reason for people to visit. It certainly is my last large piece and I've found that that's, I had said that with the last piece and the one before that, but this one is, the university has been, has meant so much to me and to my family that it really, it couldn't be better to have this as a, as a punchline to my work. It's the biggest thrill of my life. I hope that I've done them proud. Uh, whatever I got out of it has been a ton of fun and I'm so proud.